In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a mobile client for MCPE Bedrock Demise, the new update and all the features that it has to offer. The download can be found in the description down below and without further ado, let's get started. Alright boys, but in today's video, we're going to be doing a nice and chill one and basically showing you guys the brand new update of the Bedrock Demise uh, client right over here that is for mobile devices and this will actually help boost FPS and overall improve the performance of your game. Of course, a Bedrock Demise version 10.3 and once again, it can be found in the description down below but first off take a look at the title screen guys it looks completely different um as you can tell we have like a bunch of information over here it tells us our minecraft ign we have the beautiful minecraft bedrock demise logo right over there along with the text at the bottom and a different placement of the buttons over here that is honestly super duper amazing we have the profile marketplace the settings but anyways guys let's press on a play right now and let's join a world and let me just show you guys the major difference that it actually does make so we're gonna be joining this one world right now and i'm gonna show you exactly what difference it has to make but basically uh the better optimized client adds a bunch of new settings to the game that actually improves your um performance significantly so i highly recommend downloading it and it is super easy but here we are guys in the minecraft world and one thing that you will notice right off the bat is that we have this thing in the corner of our screen a compass and a clock right over there so the compass obviously pointing to wherever the spawn is that is a new feature guys and that is super useful because if you build like your house towards spawn then you guys can simply use this client in order to get back home and of course do not forget the clock that we do have right over there in the corner of our screen it will tell us what time it is so we know when things are going to get dark when it's going to be daytime and all of that good stuff another thing that you'll notice is that the ui is completely changed to be more optimized and look far more better and easier to use so over here guys if we go to our settings we actually have a quick camera perspective option right over here that you guys can press over here so we have the first person we have the, the back person that's how it looks like pretty cool if i do say so myself and this is is uh, the front and that is honestly so cool it is super easy to use and I absolutely love it but we also have a, a bunch of new different and new settings to this client right over here if we scroll down over here it actually does uh, sort it out for us for example we have the common settings over here which I'm pretty sure uh, you guys already seen what these um you know settings already look like but we also have new things over here in graphics as well and over here is actually the new settings in advanced video you guys can actually change the maximum frame rate the lower you put it the better your game should perform I know that these texture packs don't give you the biggest FPS boost sometimes. However, very rarely it can actually help you. But either way, this is still an amazing client. It has a beautiful UI and it is super useful to use. And the settings are far more organized. But over here, uh, you guys can actually turn that on or off depending on whatever you like. And over here, this is the audio settings over here, which I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys already know about that. And over here, we have the regular control settings. And over here is all of the information about the better optimized client over here. It tells you all the features. So we actually have a single tap F5 toggle. We have organized settings, a new start screen, uh, low foliage, remove water fog, um, an added better optimized title, replace item group icons with arrows, and a change selected items to green and uh, grass paths have a top texture on all six. So that is pretty cool. And shout outs to Nether Ninja for creating this amazing client over here. And, um, you know, special thanks to all these people who helped out significantly. And, um, yeah, make sure to read the terms of use as well. But also, if you want the best best performance simply go over here to recommendations and it will tell you exactly what settings you need to use in order to get the best performance of your game uh, so you guys can take a look at that we have to turn our render distance all the way down particle render distance as well and all that cool stuff you know fancy bubbles off fancy graphics off and basically stuff you would normally expect so that is honestly very 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 cool and also all of the textures are made to be far more simpler and of course particles are removed as well you know just to make the game uh you know a little bit easier for your devices to handle and another the cool thing about this shader is that they actually made the water far more clearer so if you actually notice um you know in the water it actually looks far more clear which is incredibly useful in case you're trying to find like an ocean monument or any cool stuff like that and this is honestly such a useful yet simple client right over here but anyways guys that is pretty much it for today's video i do apologize for the short video recently there has been a lot of test uh you know going on at my school so i just figured that making shorter videos would be good as well however you know just making short videos to the point not stretching out anything is good as well but once again if you like to download this it can be found in the description down below but anyways guys please like comment and subscribe see you later french fries